Tama Isidore Noel Sankara was a Burkina Bay military officer, Marxist revolutionary, and Pan-Africanist, who served as president of Burkina Faso from his coup in 1983, to his deposition and murder in 1987. Viewed by supporters as a charismatic and iconic figure of revolution, he is commonly referred to as Africa's Che Guevara. As an admirer of the Cuban Revolution, Sankara set up Cuban-style committees for the defense of the revolution. As such, he prioritized gender equality, slashed the wages of his top officials and set up popular revolutionary tribunals to keep public officials charged with political crimes and corruption, considering such elements of the state counter-revolutionaries. He changed and renamed the country from the French colonial name Upper Volta to Burkina Faso, meaning land of incorruptible people. Thomas Sankara lived a modest and straightforward life despite being president of Burkina Faso. He drove the cheapest car in the country, declined to have his portrait hung in public places, and rejected air conditioners in his office. He lowered his monthly salary to $450. Thomas Sankara said, Comrades, there is no true social revolution without the liberation of women. May my eyes never see and my feet never take me to a society where half the people are held in silence. I hear the roar of women's silence. I sense the rumble of their storm and feel the fury of their revolt. He died at the young age of 37, living behind two children. Burkina Faso is restoring Thomas Sankara's legacy with the bronze statue. He will always be remembered as one of the greatest Pan-Africanists. Remember to like, share and subscribe.